Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about how to use auto drive in conjunction with course play. Mainly it's going to be how do we use auto drive to refill an implement once it's run out of, uh, for our case, lime, when, when doing a field. First thing we want to do is we want to open as course play hood and we want to go into the settings menu and then click advanced settings. And what we want to do is we want to make sure this setting here is set to fill for unload stroke refill. Once you've selected that setting, click OK. You will need to do that for every tractor or implement you're using that you want to use auto drive for whenever you open it up. I've already created a course on auto drive. It goes from field 2, which is what we're currently working in, all the way down to the line filler, and then back again. What we've got is we've got 123 litres of line left, so I'll set this course going, and then when it's ready to fill again, what it'll do is it'll look for the auto drive course, follow it all the way round, all the way to the lime station, fill up with lime, come all the way back to field 2 again, and then it'll carry on from its course play course where it left off. So what I'll do is I'll just set this track to go in. I'm not going to cover how to set up routes in auto drive. If you're new and you've never used auto drive before, go and check out my auto drive playlist. That'll show you how to create routes and waypoints and how to add on to existing waypoints and things like that. If you like this video or any other videos that I've uploaded to my channel and you want to see more, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring notification bell to get alerts every time new videos are uploaded. And also check out the featured channels page for some other great YouTubers that upload some great content. Hit their subscribe button as well, I'm sure they'll really appreciate it. just coming up to empty now now what the tractor will do is it will look for the auto drive course it will head for field 2 which is highlighted here this is just at the end of the field just can see field 2 is here it will head to that waypoint and then it will make its way to the next one which will be lying As you can see, lime's highlighted in green now, so that's the next target waypoint. With these refill stations that I'm currently using, it did take a bit of manoeuvring of the waypoints to get it close enough to hit the tip triggers because they are really small. You might find you just have to put a waypoint down and just keep doing it trial and error until you find a position where it works.
As you can see, I've got them set up for seeds, fertilizer, and lime. I've also set my auto drive to the load function. I've set it to field 2 where it needs to start, which is the current field we're working in. The waypoint where it needs to fill up, which is the line one. And then the contents that it needs to fill up with, which in our case is lime. The tractor's just coming back to the field 2 waypoint now. Once it hits the waypoint, it'll then continue back on its course play course at the current waypoint where it left off. As you can see, it's just unfolding the implement now. And now it'll carry on with course play course until it either gets to the end of the course or it runs out of lime again. Don't forget, if you like this video, click the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.